This may be my most disliked video, considering the state of hip hop, but someone has got to say this. <laughs> Welcome to MC Mind, I am Deluxe TL. Today we are covering how to rap sober. That's right, sober. You need to watch this if you can't freestyle right without drinking, without smoking weed, or other influences. Ghost weed. What is ghost weed? Ghost weed is the use of marijuana and other mind altering drugs to freestyle or write raps. What's the harm you say? Ghost weed is the gateway drug to ghost writers. Preach! I know many of you like to smoke or drink before writing lyrics or freestyle rapping. You feel it helps you get your mind right and take the edge off of feeling self-conscious about your rapping ability. I warn you, my brothers and sisters, this episode is meant to be a caution, not a judgment of your lifestyle choices. There's no judgment here. If you are of age and it's legal where you reside, there's nothing wrong with these things in moderation. The danger comes in when you notice that the only way you can begin to be creative and write rap is when you're smoking or drinking. I know what you're thinking. I'm being hypocritical. Yet, despite my locks and my droopy eyelids, I am not a smoker nor a drinker. I don't say this to brag. I just believe I create better lyrics when I am fully present for the creation process. In my opinion, weed and alcohol dulls the senses. Besides, my drugs of choice are sugar and caffeine. So get your mind right. What does this really mean to get your mind right? Does it really get your mind right or do you just think it does? In Portland, Oregon, we have this great weekly hip-hop event called Wicked Wednesday. Shouts out to DJ Wicked. This event's usually held at a nightclub or a bar. So there's alcohol present. And at midnight, the mic opens up for MCs to get on the mic and freestyle. So I imagine in events like this across the country, there are thousands of drunken flows where rappers think they sound like this. There was the manic to the best of us, the rest of us kick up the dust and scream the cuss and storm the front for what we want, but we do not. When in reality, they sound like this. Uh, I'm in the game, trying to get this fame. Look at me, cause them other rappers lame. I think we can all agree that drugs and alcohol alter perceptions. Your rhymes feel good, but when you hear them back, they're not what you expected. Freestyling takes awareness and mental quickness. And if you've ever been the sober one in the room, you know what I'm talking about. Despite how it feels, weed slows down your processing. It just takes the edge off. What this sounds like to me is they smoke out the inner hater. Inner hater is like, yeah, you suck. Why are you rapping? Oh, why are you gonna... <coughs> Being high is used to escape the stress of your creation process. The problem is if you never learn how to handle your nerve and silence the inner hater, it takes more and more weed to create. I truly believe you can freestyle where you naturally suspend your judgment, silence the hater, and spit with full presence of mind. This video was made in response to the present condition of popular hip hop culture, knowing that present hip hop culture will influence future generations of MCs. To my young and up and coming MCs out there, your life choices are yours to make. This video is only meant to be a caution to intoxicated inspiration. Developing this craft is a frustrating and emotional journey, but when your mind is fully present, you will develop sharper skills. So remember, these are just my views, and again, the choice is yours. Thank you for watching MC Mind. We are out of here, but before we bounce, remember to subscribe to the channel, like the video, and in the comments, let's have a good old-fashioned debate. Here's the point you're debating. Ghost weed is bad for rappers. In the comments, tell me whether you agree or disagree with this statement and why. Please keep your comments respectful of each other. I'm sure there'll be some nuanced disagreements to the points I'm making in this video, and I welcome that. Just because we disagree doesn't mean we have to be a bunch of meanie heads. All right, so that's it. Thank you again for watching Deluxe DL. Check us out on Instagram at MCMind. That's where you'll see our favorite comments posted on YouTube from the videos at MCMind. And as always, skills over all and speak your truth.